everyone. My name is Grace Del Molino, and I'm one of the professors in the Italian department here at UC Davis. And I've been asked to record a brief promotional video to talk about a couple of the reasons why you might consider majoring in Italian studies at Davis. One reason. We have small class sizes in our program, which means that you get to know your professors really well, and I get to know you. And that has a big impact on the quality of your educational experience. In a typical class with me, you can expect to talk, you can expect to know all of your classmates' names, you can expect to know who I am as a person, not just as a professor you see at the front of the class lecturing to you as sort of like a disembodied figure that almost doesn't seem human. You can get better recommendations from professors who know you personally. You can get better life advice from professors who know you personally. And our small classes offer you the chance to do that. Another reason, Italian is a surprisingly useful major in pretty much any conceivable career path you could think of. In today's global world, many companies are international, and speaking a second language can open a lot of doors in terms of career opportunities. Even if you don't end up using Italian, the Italian language in your day-to-day -day career, the communication skills you build in this major will serve you in literally any profession you might choose. No matter where you are, you're going to have to talk to people. You're going to have to communicate your ideas in written and spoken language. And our major op offers you an opportunity not only to practice those skills, but to get a lot of feedback from your teachers on how to improve them. Finally, you can get all of these benefits while also having a lot of fun. Italy is home to some of the world's best literature, music, food, wine, uh, scientific inventions, cars, fashion, pretty much any uh, domain of artistic or human production you can think of, Italy has left a big mark. And that's true not just of the modern period, but also the medieval and renaissance time periods, which are the subject matter that I teach most frequently. I personally study medieval Italian literature, which is turning out to be surprisingly relevant to the present day. I just finished a course on Boccaccio's Decameron, which is set during the Black Death that struck Florence in 1348. And the human response to the pandemic in the Middle Ages is surprisingly similar to what we're seeing today in response to coronavirus, right? I'm talking to you from my house because I cannot go into my office or teach my classes in person. In the Middle Ages, Boccaccio describes people fleeing their neighbors, um, abandoning friends in the streets, being afraid of the, even the clothes of a sick person. And we're seeing that fear of contamination today. But Boccaccio also reminds us that the greatest human virtue is compassion. We have to love our neighbor. We have to love our friends and show care and respect and compassion for those around us if we want to survive as a society. So I think that's a pretty important message and one that you can get by taking a course like Italian 114 Boccaccio's Decameron, which is in Italian and only accessible to people who have studied the language, which you can also do at Davis. Um, a couple courses that I'm particularly excited to teach next year are a special topics course I'm holding in the fall, which is going to be about plague narratives in Italian literature. There have been more than just uh, more than just Boccaccio's, and we'll be covering some of that in that course. I'm also teaching a course on the history of consent. We're going to cover everything from the Me Too movement to ancient Greek philosophy to digital privacy rights on your iPhone and how consent impacts your everyday use of technology. So I hope I've given you an impression of what you can expect to find in the Italian major here at Davis, and I am always available for any questions you might have. My name is Grace Del Molino. You can find my contact easily on the website and reach out to me if you'd like to know more. Thanks for watching.